Oh, twist! Twist! Could it be? It's Rutherford gone. Wasn't unsure to begin with, but then pushed long on back. And Sherfain Rutherford has hit it straight down the throat of that man on the fence who picks up another catch, Mohammed Nawaz. Nazim Shah. Another one down. They've lost three now. That's the third to go. Lamambi departs. It's procession right now for the Karachi Kings. Have been that short of a length and no timing. Jubilee safe hands if the car Ahmed with the catch. Nasim Shah, first delivery wicket. There's another one. Another one goes. He's on a hat trick as well. Two wickets in two balls, and he's only just started his spell. And they've now lost four. On any other day, that would go crashing to the boundary. In the end, there's a thin under edge and an easy catch through to the captain. Got him. Gone. Inside edge and onto leg stump and another one goes. Still in the air, it hasn't landed by that angle at least. Oh, he's cleaned him up for sure, inside edge onto the stumps. Yeah, it's gone up a long way. Should be taken, man comes in and then backtracks a little bit. And a uh, simple catch. Befitting that he, that man, Naseem Shah, picks up the wicket. Just falling apart here, Karachi. Try and get the big hit in Iftikhar. Right down his throat, doesn't miss those. And that is that. Decent catch, decent catch. Had to be a little aware where the boundary rope was behind. And in the end, five wickets for Nassim Shah. What a performance from Nassim Shah. What a bowler he is. Let's hope that he uh, looks after himself. Let's hope that he gets... And he finishes it well, chopped on. So Nassim Shah has the last say. And you can see from his reaction what it means to him and his team. And what pace it is as well, 147.3. They've got one, Gobar's gone for 19. Oh, what a delivery first up, and up goes that dreaded digits. He struck first ball, Nassim Shah, he is a serious, serious talent. He was about 15 minutes late on that, was Azai. He struck his boot and he was on the bike straight. Didn't even look at the umpire, didn't even think of a review because that was crashing middle. Zazai out for one, Pishawa five for one. Got him! That is magnificent! Nassim Shah is on fire! What a start from him! And what a start for Quetta! We got a little message from James Vince as he was coming out to bat is nowhere. Feet don't go anywhere, but I tell you what, that off pole does. It's gone up a long way, should be, should be taken. Yeah, is taken. And so here, Tanvir with uh, more, more words to be said. I don't think we need any of that anymore. Ben Cunning has made uh, quite an impact on the game with the bat. And he has his side now at 182 for six. But to cut down in the end by this, trying to go leg side, a little bit late on it, maybe the extra pace from Nassim. And again, similar result. It is so difficult to hit. It is such good bowling. In this over, a couple of times, it's gone straight up in the air. And both the cutting and now Talat falling to straightforward catches. So great innings, fine innings from Hussein Talat, 51 from 33, but it's now seven down for 184. Nassim Shah, and that one doesn't quite have the legs on it for once. That's been picked up. It's gone very high indeed, and he's picked up a wicket as well. Some change up there, Kasim Akram trying to go over the boundary. He didn't find the connection, could see him right up. Off the end of the bat, wrist coming into play, hands coming into play of Smith, Jubilee, safe hands. Pick that up. 
should be out. It is out. Nassim Shah has got himself another one. He has been quite spectacular today, Nassim Shah. His numbers are unbelievable. Two for 12 now. Three overs and three balls. Karachi King receiving some jolt. Nassim Shah could see my position, but lack of pace. That's where the problem lies. He got the elevation, but not the distance this time. Mead made sure he made no mistakes there. Rohail Nazir has to take the walk.